Hi, I'm Lanny, and this is Preserving Today, a Greener Postures Project. Today I want to tell you about home canning beans. So this is a pressure canning project that anybody can do using dried beans, water, and salt, and any spice mixes that you want to get into. The purpose of this is to replace buying store-bought beans in cans and still have the convenience of those items by not having to soak dry beans overnight and plan ahead. So planning ahead happens for me once or twice a year and I do a huge batch and I pressure can them so I can have them on my shelf ready to go in an instant. The best part about this recipe is that you can do different varieties of beans in the same canner load. Navy beans, pinto beans, kidney beans, black beans. There's so many different kinds and all of them can have different spices in each jar. So to get started, you need a pressure canner, pint sized jars, dried beans, some spices, and you're ready to go. You're gonna start by soaking your beans overnight and plan for about three fourths cup of beans per half pint jar. After the beans have soaked overnight, all you need to do is rinse them and put them in a big stock pot full of water and bring them to a boil. Once they come to a boil, you can reduce them to a simmer and simmer them uncovered for 30 minutes. During those 30 minutes, you're gonna get your pint sized jars ready and make sure they're clean and dry and then add the spices and salt to each individual jar. Once your 30 minute cook time is up, Use a slotted spoon to fill your jars with the beans, leaving one inch of headspace. Then use a ladle to pour the liquid over the beans, again, leaving an inch of headspace. Go ahead and debubble those and then adjust the headspace if necessary. Add your flat lids and your rings and put everything into your pressure canner. You're just going to pressure can them for an hour and 15 minutes. Let them cool the way you're supposed to before removing the cans. Let them sit on your counter overnight before checking the seals, wiping the jars off, labeling them, and putting them away. It can be a lot of work to do big batch cooking, but it's simple work that anybody can do that decides they want to do it. Learn how to use your pressure canner, keep it simple, and make staples like this that make your weeknight dinners easier. There's many things like this on my shelf, I put a lot of effort in on one day, and then I have the peace of mind of knowing exactly what's in the food that I'm feeding my family. Pressure canning beans at home couldn't be easier. And for all the details and to get this recipe, I put a link below in the video description for my website, preservingtoday.com. Thanks for watching. I'm Lanny, and this was Preserving Today.